Hey everybody, so I've stored a bunch of plorts in the uh, storage unit here. And I've built the, uh, I've built one drill, one pump, and apparently two apiaries. I'm out of pink plorts, so I'm going to have to get some more of those. But, uh, yeah, so I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do with these things now. <laughs> Let's see what this guy says. I built this lab after me. Yeah, I learned. I read that already. Okay, so I think it's T. Ah, there we go. In gadget mode, you cannot vac or shoot, but you can see all the build sites in the world. You can place your gadgets. Have a look around. So I can put... Cool. Okay. Um... Let's put the pump there, I guess. And I'll put the apiary here. I'm sure that if I place these things in different parts of the world, I will, uh... I will get, uh, different things. This covers basic slime science. To learn more, check out the new slime science section in your Slimepedia. It's loaded with handy info. Okay, let's see. Slime science. Refinery, fabricator, blueprints, extractors. Extractors are a special class of slime science gadgets that are essential for building all other types of gadgets. Oh, I got the extractor. Utilities, warp tech decorations and curios because why not okay so that's kind of cool um, I'm gonna need some more pink plorts to build some stuff I wonder how long it takes oh that's how long it takes okay so it'll be uh, 20 minutes until my uh, Oh, I, get, I gotta buy more blueprints. So I got blue teleporter, gray teleporter, blue warp depot, gray warp depot. That's where I can shoot stuff in, so that's cool. So I can like put one of these in the mossy blanket, one of these in the indigo quarry. Med station, hydro turret, that's to protect from slimes I guess. Slime ball hoop, slime stage. Novice gordo snare. That looks kind of cool. So uh, I'm going to go gather. I need some more pink plorts, so I'm going to gather those up, and uh, I'll get back to you guys when this thing's done. Let's see what I get. So I was ex I was just uh, getting rid of some extra slimes out here in the back of my cave, and I just noticed this area over here. So I wonder if I can explore it. There's a path. It looks like stepping stone blocks, and then there's a torch over there, so I wonder where that leads. That noise is. Oh! They're just pink slime spawning. Cute. Okay. Well, there's some cube berries. Don't need any right now, so I'm good. And then what is this? I love secret places. Oh. It's a bad area, because there's a, a danger spot, but let's see. What is this area? It's not the Indigo Quarry. Oh, there's a box here, let's see what it has. Okay, some cash and a tabby slime. Bunch of chickens and roosters. Oh! Whoa! Wow! Wow, you guys are new! And very dangerous looking. <laughs> okay. So there's some big tabby rock boom slimes. I what else there is over here. Like, I, I have no idea where this area is. Huh. Like, I wonder what it connects to. Let's see. So here's the other side of the sign. Oh, those are pretty flowers. Some pogo fruit. Some 
More stepping stones. Huh. Another treasure pod. I don't see, unless I'm supposed to go to there, but I don't really trust it. I have absolutely no idea where this is. So I guess it's just to get to that treasure pod, but... Unless they're going to put something in here eventually. That's kind of neat, so uh, just explore a new area. That's always fun. Okay, back to gathering supplies. Okay, so I just got a new upgrade called Treasure Cracker. Let's see how much that costs. Um, I just died because I'll show you in a second. There's a glitch in my game. Oh, that's expensive. Okay, I can't afford that for a bit. I can get the advanced apiary. All right. Anyway, so there's a, a glitch currently going on with this section of my ranch, and it's very disappointing. So what happens is, for some reason, this floor doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. Like, if I step off this platform, I fall through, and I have to teleport to a structure. Now, as a result of that, I can't really get to my slimes or anything. It's really annoying. Unless I'm standing on something, so I have to go over and, like, stand right on the... Ah! See, and it's, it's, it's easy to die. And I've, I've died repeatedly. Because it's like, okay... Ah, shoot. Because I have to land in just the right spot. Stand. Oh, and even then, sometimes it doesn't work, and now I'm dead. Like, I don't know what the problem is. It's driving me crazy. But my quantum slimes, my hunter slimes, are in this area, so... I'm trying to evacuate them to my, uh, science area. But the problem is, it's like... I die, I lose 12 hours, and all my crops ripen, but then they they die, and it's just, it's really frustrating. So it's like, I can't, I can't leave my hunter slimes and my uh, quantum slimes in there, because I kind of need them. So I have to try to figure out how to get in there to rescue them without losing time and uh, whatever's in my pack. So anyway, that's my current frustration, but... I'll uh, try to get as many plorts as I can to get that treasure cracker. Okay, see you guys in a bit. Okay, so I managed to rescue two hunter slimes and three quantum slimes from that area. Uh, there's chickens coming for the hunters, and it looks like these things are ready, whatever they are, so... Yeah. Oh! I got buzzwax. And a honey hexacomb from that. Okay, that's cool. What do I get from this? I got more buzzwax. Let's see, this is the pump, I think. Oh, cool. Okay, so these are full. I'm going to. I think these go in here. Yeah, and I use them to build other things, so... Spiral Steam... Hexacomb and Buzzwax. Because I can't sell them, they're not plorts. But let's see what this thing gave me. Jelly Stones! Ah, that's funny. Go solid and squishy at the same time. Okay, so that's used to make things. Now, I'm guessing... It looks like those are one time use items, and then they're gone, so I'll have to build some more. And let's see, so I got some blueprints I can build, advanced drill, advanced pump, advanced apiary, and it lasts three cycles. Okay, that's better than the one that only lasts one cycle. Uh, they're pretty expensive though, so it's going to take me some time to gather the money I need. But, uh, so I'm going to deal with that, and I'll see you guys again in a bit. So there you go, pink rad largo uh, slimes. There's my honey crystal slimes. There's my... Oh, jeepers, look at that. Plorts are on top of the pen. 
That's why these guys are pretty dangerous, and you want to keep them as far away as possible from other slimes, because when they explode, they blow their plorts everywhere, and that sounded really bad now that I said it, but anyway. So, uh, still saving up some money. I want to buy the docks as well, so I'm going to do that before the end of the episode, uh, just to see what that area looks like. And, uh, and I'm going to buy the treasure cracker and open one of the treasure pods. So actually, I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to buy the treasure cracker. So it's not cheap. It's almost 5000 but let's see what uh, it actually gets me. you got to be careful when you uh, combine slimes, because you don't want explosive slimes close to other slimes, because the plorts go everywhere. Okay, so let's see. Treasure cracker. Okay. So, I know where there's a green treasure pod, so I will go there in a sec. Okay, so here's the treasure pod that's in the cave. What do I get? What do I get? Blueprint acquired minty grass patch. Oh, so I get blueprints out of them. Well, that's good. And actually, if I uh, put these decorations down in the uh, broken area, I might be able to use that as stepping stones so I can get around. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. That almost killed me. Okay, boom slimes are dangerous. And another one here. So now I gotta try to remember where all these pods are. Blue coral columns. Coral towers whose color has shifted to the minerals found in the indigo quarry. Oh, that's cool. So, yeah, I just gotta go around trying to find all these treasure pods and see what I get out of them. And I have to heal myself. <laughs> okay, so, I wonder where all the. Oh, there's one over here. Oh, it's a blue one. Yeah, I need a more advanced treasure cracker. So I can open the green uh, treasure pods now. Well, like I said, that's pretty cool, and uh, hopefully I'll find some more of them. Okay, so I'm going to head back to my ranch, and I'm going to buy the dock area, and then that is going to be it for this video. So, see you guys in a sec. Okay, so let's buy the dock area. Deep, deep down in the great blue sea, I saw a thousand slimes smiling back at me. Okay, so let's see what this area looks like. Okay, so there's water. That's handy. There was no other place in my farm that had a ranch that had water. There's four more plots that I can build corrals or gardens, so that's useful. And a broken dock with a journal on it. Let's see what it says. A view of the sea really reminds you of our greater purpose, Beatrix. The sea was uh, the first great unknown, and then space, and then whatever's beyond all that. That need to see what's around the next corners in my bones. And since you're out here, I reckon it's in yours too. But I suppose you could also be out here because you like the fresh air, or you prefer the untamed beauty of this land, or maybe it's because you're looking to leave something far behind you. Sure is the way to do it. Doesn't get much further than this. So, that's it. I got these, uh, got the last expansion for my ranch for now. It's a really nice area. And there's these weird uh, circles. That I don't think I can do anything else. I can always put decorations in there, I guess. But uh, the four uh, patches or plots are going to come in handy. Because I'm going to need more slimes to... Uh, have more science, so that's cool. And then hopefully the glass desert will be opening soon. I wonder if I can put puddle slimes in here. Oh, and then that would free up the plot that my puddle slimes are in. So that's cool. Okay. So this area has a lot of potential. And uh, we'll explore a bit of that potential in my next video. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Oh, and I found out that the area that is broken... Like you can kind of see the ground's a little different here, and that's where the area's broken. Is it? Let's see. Oh, there it is. 
Yeah, you can see that there's no ground when you go underneath. You can see the grass, but you can't see anything else. So it's, uh, like I said, it's kind of sad and a little annoying. Because uh, I can't get the plorts from the... that were vacuumed up in those other corrals. Because if I try to stand there, I fall through and I don't have enough time. So, anyway. It is what it is. And, uh... Like I said, I've relocated my slimes for now until whatever's wrong with that area is fixed. Okay, so, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye